this is an online program and we can all meet in the computer room and do um, it together as a class. You can vote all the way through, depending which scientist you like the best. I voted for Miranda. I voted for Miranda because um, she um, came to all our chats and um, she answered all my questions and I was interested in the subject she did. Miranda won. She did um, superbugs as her subject, so I was interested in the superbugs. We got to meet the scientists at school. They came here and we got to sit in a chatterbox. And it was full of balls and you got to ask the scientists questions. So that was like really fun because it was like different experience of learning. Alright, come on, kiddo. <laughs> Hello, girls. I'm James. Good morning, girls. I'm Miranda and I'm a scientist. What's the best thing you've ever done as a scientist? I get to put samples in a machine that heats them up to a thousand degrees. You know how hot that is? Like, you... water boils at a hundred. It's super hot, and you know what it does? It can tell me if there's any metal in my sample. Yeah. So your fingertips have the most nerve endings of anywhere else in your body. How come I can do this? You've definitely got a very strong tendon. So how come people have curly hair and straight hair? Curly hair and straight hair is caused by the way the different proteins interact with each other inside those dead cells. Because of the way it spins now, it'll actually cause the whole hair to bend and to curve. But that's cool. Why are we ticklish? I know that you can't tickle yourself because your brain knows it's coming and prepares for it. Because it ha to tickle someone, it has to be really, really lightly. My brother's ticklish everywhere. Under his arm, in his belly, under his leg, everywhere. I <laughs> That was so much fun. Whee! I got buried under the balls. 